Hi, welcome to the Lion Brand Yarn Studio. We are thrilled to have with us for the third time the one and only Nikki Epstein. Welcome. Hi, Patty. Hi. I'm always happy to be here, you oh, know that. We're so thrilled to have you. And we're here to talk about Nikki Epstein's amazing brand new book, Knitting Block by Block. So <laughs> this book to me is amazing because it is literally blocks. It is knitting blocks and all the unbelievable things that you can do with them. So this is really a, a, a book that someone who knows how to knit and purl, but maybe is not a very advanced knitter, doesn't know fancy shaping, could actually make adorable garments with. That was the purpose of it, Patty. <laughs> so they can jump right in and make, so, so tell me about, for instance, this adorable it's two blocks hat. It's so. two blocks, you can wear it a couple different ways. There you go. Shall I? Sure. All you right. Can. Absolutely. Do it this way. All right, I'm going in. <laughs> I'm going to have hat hair, though. No, that's all right. Lovely. <laughs> Adorable. So it's just two blocks, and it's pinched right here. Yeah, you, you uh, square off the top, and then you simply fold it. And it <sighs> folds, and you can wear it the other way, too, and leave off the cords. Oh, all right. Hold on. Let me put you up the cords there. There you go. All right, let's do the other way. That way. All right, what do you think is better? <laughs> Both are... Devastatingly beautiful on you. Devastatingly <laughs> beautiful. Now, how about, is my hair terrible? Lovely. No, okay. This is really, the animals are what blew my mind. I know, I'm this so proud of them. This is a block? <laughs> yep, one block. Look at this. These are just one block. So it's all just about the amazingly ingenious way that they're folded together. And look at their little hands. Here, you hold on to the turtle. And this one's adorable. And I have plenty more coming. Ooh. I couldn't stop. Once I started, it was like... Oh my God, oh my God, I have a penguin at home right now. <gasps> a penguin! I brought oh. a fish with me. <laughs> oh, we love, for those of you who have been here, we have our new holiday window up and they involve penguins. So right. we're, we're very partial to right. the penguins. And one of my new line of buttons, there's a penguin on it. Oh, yeah. fantastic. So now there's also garments in here. You have beautiful capes and what is this? Gorgeous. That's Gorgeous. a hooded uh, piece with trimmed in fur. This is very glam. You missed your calling. You should have been a model. <laughs> yes. I, I don't think so, but yes. Oh. All it is is eight blocks. Oh, it has a pocket. A few, yeah, I pocketed it. And if Adorable. you don't want to use the fur, you can uh, do a cord edging. Adorable. So now, the other thing I love about the blocks is their ability to experiment with all sorts of different stitch patterns. Right. It's a real uh, easy way if you're a beginner, if you want to do a ferrule piece and you don't want to invest in a lot of money, you can just buy enough to do a small ferrule. If you like it, continue. If you don't, change and do another block. And play with I-cord and stitch patterns. Right. And, because that's what I love about... Um, just simple afghans with, that are created with afghan blocks is if you want to experiment with cable or a little lace or a stitch pattern and you don't want to commit to a giant garment, right. do right. a block. And that, the part of the purpose of the book was uh, that you can do more than just afghans with blocks. That was my key focus. Now, um, in addition to what you're obviously famous for, being a, an amazing knitwear and crochet designer, um, Nikki is not just working in the textiles but um little metal as well we we here at the studio carry nikki shawl pins and buttons and and so what inspired all these lines these amazing lines of shawl pins and buttons and clasps well jhb a company that's been around for many years asked me to do a line of buttons this was four lines ago so this that you what you're wearing will be out in january that's my fourth line nice. so but they're really fun i'm so excited about doing it and they're doing very well. Thank you every, very much. <laughs> so, yeah, they're fun. And the other thing that we're thrilled to have here at the studio is Nikki Epstein's original fiber art. So we have um, prints of them, but I just want to show you each. This is one of the five paintings. And each painting is then a different uh, stitch technique. Right. And there's actual actually yarn right there. Now, how in the world did you get the yarn on the canvas, which I've never asked you, but I've been slightly baffled by. Well, I started originally, you know, the background's acrylic, and I, I did in the, the, the uh, skeleton of a sheep and then hit the face and legs. And uh, then I just wanted to do different knitting techniques, and the way I started to sew them on and tack them on, but then I simply got a hot glue gun out and, and, and glued them on. Hot and there glue. are thousands of baubles and corky. These are actually sheep that I met in Australia. 
So they're they're named, and the technique that I used is is they're on the real, pieces. They're they're real sheep. I have oh, names and everything. Yeah, he's a Drysdale. They're different different types of, I of didn't sheep. Know that. Yeah, yeah. Well, you can so. come see the original paintings here at the Lion Brand Yarn Studio, which um, tragically at no cost are for sale. You you <laughs> at no cost. Can't, you you can't buy the originals, no. but what you can buy are sets of five greeting cards, these adorable greeting cards, and also the uh, 11 by 14 prints. And they make um, great, great holiday cards, and they're uh, absolutely adorable. I did not know they were really, oh, yeah. you met them, you became yeah. friends with them. I became friends, and this you year, immortalized them. I'm actually, I, I drew a little piece of holly on the top of each one, and I'm using them for my Christmas cards. Oh, quit it. <laughs> well, so now that reminds me, um, you have a little special holiday greeting. Oh, yes. Is that correct? Yes. Now now tell me where this came from. Every year my husband writes me uh, a poem for Christmas. We don't do gifts, so he writes a poem, I make him something. So that this was not this be was more adorable. this was this year's. Well, shall we share it? Sure, let's do it. Should I start? Yes, yeah, you start. You start. We'll do two by two rows, okay? It's called A Knitter's Christmas, of course. Of course it is. Twas the night before Christmas and all through the house, knitting needles were clicking by way of my spouse. Knit one pearl one and yarn over two, her fingers were flying, so much left to do. A ski hat for Jeff, a warm scarf for Scott, a sweater for Kenny, he's sure to look hot. <laughs> a silk shawl, shawl for Tristan, some argyles for Dad, a knit, to, a knit toy for Mason, that loquacious lad. Sure, I get the hard lines. I know, I, I, I did that on purpose, <laughs> I can't pronounce loquacious. I watch her with wonder as objects appear, some flowers, a castle, a river, a deer. And edging a ruffle are done in a whiz. She's painting with yarn, like the artist she is. Aww. Her patterns are perfect. There's never a glitch. And I know she is knitting a kiss in each Aww. stitch. <laughs> That's the name of her last book. That's so cute. I think that all knitters who labor away, give joy unto others, must feel good every day. Her needles stop clicking, nothing more left to do. And I sit down and say, Merry Christmas to you. So to all who are knitters, may I say with delight, Merry Christmas to all, and to all a good night. That's so That's cute! Sweet. <laughs> thank you. I have a really good one from last year. I think I'm going to put them up on my blog. Adorable. Well, thank you so much, Nikki, for coming. It's so wonderful every time you come and visit us. You're welcome, And darling. stay warm out there, except for you viewers who are on the West Coast, in which case we're very jealous of you. It's very cold here in New York. I'm freezing. Bye. Need lots of sweaters. Bye. Thank you, darling. <laughs> Bye-bye.